let the peace of Christ rule in our hearts so that we may strive to live with everyone in peace. Our Lord Jesus Christ, when He appeared to His disciples after resurrection, He said, Peace be with you. In today's Gospel, our Lord says that, My peace I give to you, not as the world gives do I give to you. Today, let us reflect on the peace that our Lord likes to share with us and the peace that the world gives us. St. Paul in his letter to the Galatians chapter 5 Verse 16 says, Walk by the Spirit and do not gratify the desires of the flesh. The peace that the world gives could be experienced through pleasure and satisfaction which are temporary in nature. And so, the peace that we experience through worldly things is temporary. Moreover, the peace that the world gives is pointed towards the self and tries to satisfy the self. But the Gospel according to St. Matthew chapter 5, verse 9 says, Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called the children of God. The peace that our Lord gives is the serenity that a person experiences in the midst of all the struggles of life. It helps to endure in faith with patience and face the challenges with courage, because it is the Spirit of the Lord which will be at work. The peace of the Lord guarantees that we live in God and God lives in us. And so, the peace of the Lord helps a person to love God above all else and love one's neighbor more than oneself. Dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus, as we celebrate the resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, let us strive to be called the children of God and share the peace of our Lord by loving Him above all else and loving our neighbor more than ourselves. Amen.